the Mets, meet the Mets, step right up and greet the Mets. Bring your kiddies, bring your wife, guaranteed to have the time of your life, because the Mets are really sucking the ball, knocking those home runs over the wall. East side, west side, everybody's coming down to meet the MBTS Mets of New York Town. Oh, the butcher and the baker and the people on the streets, where do they go? To meet the Mets! Oh, they're hollering and cheering and they're jumping in their seats, where do they go? To meet the Mets! All the fans are true to the orange and blue, so hurry up and come on down, cause we got There's a lot of star power with the New York Mets, but we wanted to meet two future stars in the Big Apple. Ike Davis and Josh Tolley joined us to talk about the season ahead. Well, you, you go over to the big league camp, everybody's still raving about the spring that you've had. Are you still in awe of, of what you guys were able to put together? Uh, you know, not really. You know, in 24 bats, you can you can do basically about anything. You can go over 24 or 18 for 24. And, you know, I just I put some uh, good swings on some balls, and, and it happened, you know, to find the holes. Was there a much of an awe factor going into your first big league camp and getting a much exposure as you were able to have uh you know the off factor was just being you know on the field with the you know the all-stars and stuff that i've watched my whole life and you know having a locker close to david wright was pretty cool and and uh that's a bit that was the off factor but it's you know after the first couple of games it you know it kind of got settled into you know playing there clearly you're a ball player are you also a fan uh for sure you know i uh i grew up watching the cubs and then then the dimebacks came to arizona so i started watching the dimebacks a lot and you know it, my dad was a baseball player, so like it kind of just ran in the family. I was gonna say it had to be just like second nature for you yeah. to be around the game, and then take his influence too. How much does that play in a factor? Oh, it's huge. My whole life, you know, I got a little like help from a big leaguer and, and advice and you know knowledge that kids at young age didn't get, and so it definitely helped me through my career so far. You're heading into your first AAA season, what's on the checklist, so to speak, for Ike Davis? Um, just go out and, and, uh, you know, be prepared every day and, and go out there and put some bats together and, and, uh, you know, really just try to help the team. Defensively, you're about as crisp as anybody that's in the system as well. For you, which do you take more pride in? Uh, definitely defense. You know, defense, I'm, I feel, you know, defense really helps the team win and offense, it's either there one day or not the, you know, you're not, you're not going to drive in three runs every day, but you know, if you, if you can eliminate, you can help eliminate runs every day and, uh. I think that's really the biggest thing in baseball is defense. As we sit here today and talk about the big league team plus your time here in minor league camp really hasn't been that extensive. You've got to have a certain feel for the guys that have already been down here. Either you saw them in big league camp oh, earlier this yeah. year or, or ready to go in Buffalo. Well, I know most of the guys down here, you know, just from prior years and, and, um, and some of the guys that have come down from big league camp. So, you know, I do know a lot of these people, and I am there is a lot of new people this year. So I'm trying to, you know, get to know everybody and, and get settled in. Ike Davis at first base, Josh Tolley, those are some of the prospect names that we hear out. Can you give us a Reader's Digest version of this club that we're ready to see in Buffalo? Um, we're we're going to try, you know, we're going to come out every day and give it all we can. And, and um, you know, that's all we can do really is, is go out there and be prepared and, 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 and play as hard as we can. Roller coaster spring and a roller coaster last couple of months for Josh Tolley. Has it felt like you've been on a roller coaster since your September first promotion? Yeah, it has. You know, I had a chance to go down to Venezuela play a little winter ball. Uh, then I had a chance to go to Dallas to uh, you know work on my uh, catching skills a little bit. And then right away, February third, got down here, got ready for spring. Everybody raves about your approach at the plate, but what are you working on most behind the plate when it comes to the catching? I uh, definitely, you know, trying to get a good relationship with the starting pitchers, uh, the bullpen guys, just kind of get an idea of what everybody you know likes to do. So that's uh, that's my goal right now, uh, you know, trying to go into the season. How has big league camp helped you attain those goals moving forward? Um, you know, I, I got a good feel, um, you know, going up there, being able to talk to some of the veteran guys on, uh, you know, 
you know, what they do, what their approach is, uh, you know, how they run a staff. So, you know, I try to take as much as I can from them guys and uh, bring it down here. Is there an ease of, of comfort now in spring training versus when you went up first in September and dealing with all the hoopla of the New York media and everything? Yeah, most definitely. I mean, you know, anytime you get thrown into that environment, you know, it's uh, definitely, you know, something I've never, ever faced in my life. But, you know, get a second chance at it in spring training, kind of, you know, kind of know the ins and outs more so than anything. How anxious are you to get actually on the field and, and really participate in some games that truly do matter? I can't wait. You know, it's, uh, you know, spring training's, uh, you know, fun when, you know, once it gets going. But, uh, you know, we're to the point where, you know, we're ready to get the season started. It's a lot, Josh. Okay, you got it. Thank you.